Salutations and hallucinations, oh steam defenders, back again for vaping with Uncle Jojo. I want to welcome y'all back to the vape cave. Y'all thought, <coughs> excuse me, my allergies are still having fun at my expense. We are once again doing Bryce's Blends. This is their vanilla cream flan. I ordered this because I love me some flan. Now people ask, what is flan? So folks at Bryce, I'm going to advise y'all, just a little free advice. Y'all need to put flavor profiles up. That's my honey. Now, to tell y'all what flan is, flan is, is is a French dessert. It's baked custard. Now, we're not talking about that crap you find at the buffet line where they took some sponge cake, squirted some uh, icing in the middle of it. No, that's a Twinkie. No, that's not a flan. We're not talking about the, the powdered mix that you got off the back of the truck. No, that's... Mm -mm. We sure ain't talking about no Jello pudding mix neither. None of that there. None of that there is going to qualify. It's got to be made right. That means it's made with milk, or in this case, cream, which is where the cream comes in, and eggs and all that good stuff. And it's baked. Now I'm going to tell you all what. It's absolutely delicious. It's oh god, it's delicious. And Bryce, there's got to be some fat folk at Bryce. I ain't knocking it. I'm fat folk too. Fat folk love food. Fat folk love dessert. And good Lord. <laughs> With this right here, before we even go any further, I'm going to say this. This has moved into my top, in my top five favorite vapes of all time. And uh, Bryce has now moved up into my top group of vapors. There's only there. I've got about five or six vendors that I really just absolutely adore. Bryce just joined them and bumped some, somebody got bumped down. Y'all are now right there. Y'all are number, I'm going to go ahead and say it. Y'all my number two vendor. That's saying a lot for me. Because number one vendor's been there for over a year. The other one's been there for whoo, probably about seven months, seven, eight months. That's saying something. I'm picky on my juice, people. There's a lot of juices. I like them. Don't mean I'm going to vape them a lot. This is one of them. What we're going to be playing with today, of course, is Segele 150. With that beautiful J Rap from JRaps.com. They made that for me. Not for free, but I ain't knocking it, baby. This is some good work. Now, of course, we're going to be running the Mutation X, that dual coil dripper. Didn't think I was going to like it. When special when I got it and looked at it, it said, Good Lord, it looked like a 410 shotgun. <laughs> Seriously, folks. But I'm going to tell you what, I've been impressed. I love my Mutation X. And we, you know, as you can see, I'm, I'm running kind of low here. Because I'm going to be honest with y'all. Y'all see how low it was. They're full all the way up. They're pretty much up to the line up here. And it's almost. It, it's emptying out. It's emptying out. I might not have enough to, to make it till nightfall with this one. The strawberry cupcake made it all little, almost four days before I entered out that little 15. This one. I'm getting fairly. I'm, I'm down. I'm done, down to a third of the bottle. <laughs> I'm a third of the way through the bottle. It's not going to make it till dark. Oh, that is thick, rich vanilla custard. This is custard done right. I'm serious. This is probably one of the better, probably easily the best custard I've ever had. And my favorite vendor of all time makes a fantastic French vanilla custard. But I'm sorry. This, oh God. Oh, this is my favorite custard. This is the best custard I've ever tried. Nick's Blissful Brews has one. Smoke Custard Plus is really excellent, excellent. Uh, Big Willie's Custard does another excellent one. You know, there's uh, Dr. Creamy's OD, which is French Vanilla Custard. All of y'all, I'm sorry. I'm going to offend some people, but that's the, what's the name of the game. Y'all just step aside. They call this Master Custard. This is the Grand Master of Custard right here. If Yoda was a custard, there he is. Woo! God, that's awesome. <laughs> yeah, this, not only have they moved up in the world, in my estimation of vaping, they have bumped several people down. That includes Cosmic Fog. 
Boosted, Alpha Juice, Omega Juice. It might be the same company, Alpha and Omega. But hey, whew. <laughs> What the? Sorry, folks. My Segele went absolutely back. Crap. So check Atomizer. Then it jumped up to 9.1 ohms. I'm like, what in the hell? How did you go from 0 0.6 to 9? Yeah, the batteries won't fire that down. Huh? They won't throw them kind of bolts. Good Lord. I need a, one, I need a 220 outlet for that. But I had, I, I've seen the IPVs do it. Uh, this Segele here, I've got two other Segele 150s and then the Segele 30. All of them do it a little bit. This one does it more than any one I've ever had. I've got, uh, out, of, but out of my two Teslas, they never do it. So I'm not sure what the deal is with that. But And I've seen IPVs do it. Oh, God, yes, that's good. Man, you literally want to just chew on. You just want to grab a hold of those clouds and pull them back in and chew on them. They're that good, man. Oh, man. This is just, this is the bomb. Now, y'all need, I'm going to put the link. The links are all going to be down right down at the bottom. Y'all look, they're all down there. Run over to Bryce's and Gravy. So if you like a good, thick French vanilla custard, or I'm sorry, just a straight vanilla baked custard, you got to get you some of this. This is, oh, God. God, that's good. That's the bomb. Woo! The next one up we're going to do next week is uh, Holy Cannoli. You only never tried a cannoli. Lord, where you been? You need to get a hold of your cannoli. I didn't want sure about a cannoli vape, though. Sounds good in principle, but I don't know. It's kind of one of them. Looks good in theory. Looks good on paper. We're not quite sure if that's going to work. I was hesitant, but I decided to pull the trigger. Saved it for last. I was kind of scared of it. After trying the first two bottles, I'm actually looking forward to it. Um, <laughs> man, Bryce, yeah, I'm serious. Y'all are, are my top five. Y'all actually, to be honest with you, y'all now number two. You, got your, you, you actually have my favorite. You are my favorite custard. You got my favorite strawberry, too. Hmm. I'm just being honest. That's amazing. Now, one more thing. Besides their links and links to both their web page and their Facebook page will be there. Right up under that, you're going to see the vape cave. That's where we at. Now, the funny thing is, see, I freed up a whole bunch of time. I had a whole bunch going on. I was adminning for five, about five for five different rooms on Facebook. Got to be too, too time consuming. Uh, plus, this beautiful lady I'm trying to date, this drop dead gorgeous, mega hot, blue eyed blonde. She's the bomb diggity. And, and uh, Big Daddy Smoogle wants to make that his, his main squeeze. They wanted all that boo-boo, you know what I'm saying? Now, to try to shift a lot of things around, I gave up. I dropped two of those rooms, bowed out, um, took a bunch of other. And of course, I've got the this. This doesn't take up much time. This whole YouTube thingy um, just freed up a whole lot of time and wound up to spend with three Facebook rooms and her and this, and wound up with one Facebook. I uh, wasn't even given a chance to do anything but that. But I was like, okay, that's fine. It's cool. No big deal. No hard. Ain't nothing, nothing gone, nothing bad. Nothing like that. Just how it worked out. I was like, okay. So I freed up the time for just have me some extra time. There ain't wrong with that. So I figured, what the heck? I'll start me a room. I ain't trying to blow it up. But hey, what the heck? I'm just trying to start a room where you can come in. Feel free to talk about vaping of any kind. Uh, if you want to do a little horse trading back and forth, remember it ain't none of me. I ain't got responsible for you trading for with, with so and so over yonder. Just saying, you want to come in and talk about vaping? You see, we Second Amendment. But you're gonna be Second Amendment friendly in the vape cave. You see this, right? Let me introduce you right quick. That's Olga. That's my Glock 20. Highly modified nail driver. Got the ported barrel, beaver tail laser, trigger job. Oh yeah, she got some. She she bad. You know, got the polymer mag well on her. Oh, yeah, she bad. She bad to bone. This is my concealed carry weapon here. This is what I'm fully licensed. That's what I carry with me everywhere I go. That's Isabella La Petite. Again, Olga the Infidel. Don't believe me? Hold up. Come here, boo. 
Huh. What did I say? Infidel, baby. That's right. And as you can see, she is not loaded. Magazine loaded. Weapons are not loaded. She is, because she's going back in my holster here in just about a minute or so. All right. That's it. I'm out of here. Second Amendment friendly. Come join me in the vape cave just to hang out and just chill. That's all we're there for. We're going to chill out, help each other, learn something, teach somebody something. That's what it's all about. Um, topics on hand, anything to do with vaping. You want to talk about guns, knives, tactical flashlights, all that. That's fine, too. Pretty much anything. Just kind of keep it clean. It's going to be, you know, liable to have grown folk in here. They're going to, they're going to have their kids with them. And, you know... We're basically family oriented, okay? So we're going to try to keep it called kind of clean down and calm down. No disrespect, and everybody just has some fun. That's all it's all about. Having fun. May the Lord bless you as He's blessed me. I'm about to get up out of here and go sit on my couch. Think I'm going to go play some video games. Yes, I play a little Black Ops 2, a little Destiny on the PS3 now. That's right, 3 Enigma. I ain't no good, but that don't mean nothing. I just, I'm just having fun. Now, y'all have a good night. And as always, remember, Uncle Jojo loves you and he wants you to know nothing but the best for you. And as always, folks, peas and cornbread.